Now I want to take my time and soak you out of my, this strip it bear, break you up and then push it back together again with God everlasting word. Amen. All right, viewers, I want you to follow me now. You that are here, get this now. Second Timothy chapter two, when we're at verse 15. All right, begin at verse 14, I if you will. At verse 14. Yes. Of these things, put them in remembrance. Do you hear this? The Apostle Paul, born in Tarsus, in the city of Cilicia, set under the feet of Gamaliel, yeah. whom the scripture says was a Pharisee, a doctor of the law. Being a Pharisee, he was a believer in the spirit world. And Paul being taught according to the perfect manner of the law, came out the tribe that gave Israel their first king, which was the tribe of Benjamin. And Paul being a Benjamite, a Hebrew of the Hebrews, circumcised the eighth day, circumcised the eighth day of the stock of, of, Israel, the, stock of Israel, of the tribe of, of, the tribe of Benjamin, and Hebrew of the Hebrews, Hebrew of the Hebrews, as touching the law, as touching the law, a Pharisee, a believer in the spirit world, concerning zeal, concerning a zeal, persecuting the church, persecuting the church, touching the right, touching the, in the right law, things that was in the law, blameless, blameless, amen. So he was taught according to the perfect manner of the law by a man named Galmelia, who was a doctor of the law. But he was not taught the revelation by man. I am verily a man which am a Jew. Listen at this. In Acts chapter 22 and at verse 3. I just want to give you some of the apostles' background here. That's right. And I don't have to go to the seminary school theology or history to do it. That's right. I go right to the Bible. That's right. Listen at this. Acts chapter 22 and at verse 3. Yes. I am verily a man which am a Jew. I am a man that's a Jew. Born in Tarsus. Born in Tarsus. A city in Cilicia. City in Cilicia. Yet brought up in this city at the feet brought of the in this city at the feet of Gamaliel and taught and taught according to the perfect manner of the law of the Father. So that lets you know even before Jesus appeared to Paul That's right. he was taught, taught that it was one God. That's right. Because all the Jews knew about Jehovah. That's right. Elohim. Yahweh, El Shaddai, That's right. the one true God of the prophets and of the Hebrews that brought him out of the land of Egypt. That's right. So he had that knowledge, That's right. but he just didn't have the knowledge of who he was. That's right. He knew it was one, but God introduced himself to Saul. Yes. Saul was a murderer, mm -hmm. persecutor. Injurious, blasphemer. Yeah. On the road to Damascus, the light shined from heaven above the brightness of the sun, knocked them down to the earth, and the Lord God himself spoke from heaven. Amen. Saul, Saul, while persecutors thou me, he asked, Who art thou, Lord? Who are you? And the Lord said, You see, Paul knew that the law was Jehovah That's right. of the Old Testament. That's right. Yeah. That's right. I said Paul knew that the Lord was Jehovah and taught according of the Old Testament. For the Bible says he was taught according, according to the perfect manner of the law of the to fathers. To the perfect manner of the law of the fathers. That's right. And, and he said, Who art thou, Lord? Who art thou, Lord? And, and the, the Lord, Lord said, said, I am Jesus. So Jesus, who is the Lord, Jesus, who is God. That's right. Jesus, who is Jehovah. That's right. Stop, Brother Paul. And uh, he was blinded by this great light. Went to the street that was called Street. There was a certain disciple down there by the name of Ananias. That's right. Lord dealt with Ananias, Ananias laid hands on brother Paul that he may receive the sight, baptized him, and brother Paul also received the baptism of the Holy Ghost. God made Paul an apostle, an ambassador of Christ. So even though he was taught the law by Gamaliel, 
His revelation came from God in the first chapter of the book of Galatia. And verse 11. Says what? But I certify you, brother. I want to certify you, brothers, that the gospel, that the which was gospel me that I preach is not after man. Do you hear this? Amen. It's not man's gospel. That's right. But what? For I neither received it of man. I didn't get it from man. Paul, tell the world how you got it. Neither was I taught it. But what? But by the revelation of Jesus Christ. It was revealed. Hallelujah. <laughs> Hallelujah. Blessed be God. It was revealed to Paul. That's right. Made known to him. That's right. So Paul didn't walk with Jesus in the flesh. No. But everything, everything that he preached concerning the flesh, God revealed to him. But when it pleased God. When it pleased, give chapter and verse from this. Galatians chapter 1 and at verse 15. When it pleased God to separate me from my mother's, from my mother's womb, womb and, and call me, by, me his by his mercy. To reveal his son in me. He did what? To reveal his son in me. For what reason? That I might preach him among the heathen. And then what? Immediately I conferred not with flesh and blood. Glory to God. Hallelujah. That's a good background on Brother Paul, isn't it? That's right. So Paul was an apostle called and sent by God. And uh, Brother Timothy mm -hmm. was one of Paul's, if I use the word, ministers. That's right. Timothy. That's right. Now, according to history, not the Bible, not the Bible, <laughs> not the Bible, not the Bible. That's right. According to history, not the Bible. According to seminary school and theology, not the Bible. Timothy supposedly had been the first bishop in the church. That's a lie. That's a lie. That's a lie. That's right. Let me show you what Timothy was. In 2 Timothy chapter 4 and at verse 5. Says what? But watch thou in all things. Look at Paul instructing his son in the gospel. That's right. Watching everything. Endure affliction. Endure suffering. Do the work of an evangelist. No. Do the work of a bishop. Do the work of an evangelist. The Bible give you his office. Amen. And give you the charge that Paul gave him. I charge thee before God and the Lord do, Jesus Christ. Do you Christ. hear this? In 2 Timothy chapter 4 and at verse 1. You see the word of God got all the answers we need. That's why we don't need seminary school here. That's right. We don't need it, don't want it, don't have confidence in it. That's right. Listen. I, 2 Timothy chapter 4 and verse 1. That's what? I charge thee before God. I charge thee before God. And the Lord Jesus Christ who shall judge the quick and the dead. At his appearing and his kingdom. What did he charge Timothy to do? Preach the go word. Go to seminary school. Preach the word. No, go to go to seminary school. Preach the word. Preach what? Preach the word. How often? Be instant in season. Hmm. Amen. Be instant in season. Out you know he didn't he didn't let up on the ministers, did he? No, no, he didn't. He didn't. Paul didn't let up on the ministers. No. He told him what? Be instant in season. Be consistent. That's right. You don't read where Timothy was whining. I don't want to go. It's <laughs> oh, too. Oh no. It was. It's too hard. No. Hear not no. that. No, no. Preach the word. Preach it. Be instant in season. And be Out consistent. It doesn't matter what time of year. That's right. Snow falling. Be instant. Be instant. Sun shining. Season. Yeah. Be instant. Yeah. If it's raining, be instant. Yeah. Wife sick. If you got one, you still be instant. That's right. That's right. Eh? That's right. You hear what the word said? Preach the word. Be instant in season. Out of season. Be consistent. That's right. And when you go out there, what should you do? Reprove. I want you to lay everything out that's not like God. Rebuke. Rebuke everything that's not like God. Exhort. I'm not sending you out there to make friends. That, that's right. I'm not sending you out there to be nice. That's right. I'm not sending you out there to be God. I'm not sending you out there to get a pat on the back. Reprove. I'm charging you to do what God charged me to do. That's right. Eh? Reprove. When you go out there, I want you to reprove. Prove the world of sin. Rebuke. Rebuke the powers of hell. Exhort. Exhort the church. With all long suffering and, and suffering. suffer in the process. And don't forget to stay in the doctrine. For the time will come. And I can say the time is here. And they will not endure sound doctrine. They don't want, they won't, they won't want to hear you, Timothy. They, That's right. They will not want to hear you. But after their own lust. But they're going to go after their own lust. They heap to and they going to gather to themselves and even get teachers. Having that want to hear what they want to hear. And they shall turn away. 
away their ears from the truth and what and shall be turned unto fable you see the apostle giving him good instruction that's right before he sent him out that's right he yeah, instructs him yeah. let him know what to do and what to expect when you get out there. That's right. Yeah. But watch thou when all You don't see where Timothy just jumped up and took off running? No. No, he had an apostle. That's right. Teach him, instruct him, lay groundwork to him. That's right. That way when you go out there, he's prepared. That's right. Teach him how to expect the unexpected. Watch thou. He told him, watch thou. In all things. What? Watch thou in all things. It's wonderful, brother. That's watch right. thou in all things mean be careful. Amen. Be mindful. That's right. Don't overlook nothing. That's right. Take your time. That's right. Watch thou. Watch thou in he, all even things. Even watch brothers that say they brothers. Watch them. That's right. Yeah. That's right. Watch them. In all things. Watching everything. Them that compliment you. That's right. Watch them. That's right. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Blessed be God. Hallelujah. Them that may get happy watch. while you're preaching, that's watch right. them. That's right. If you get a wife, that's all right. Watch her. That's right. Wow. She, that's in the right. Bible says. Watch though in all things. In how much? In all things. In how much? In all things. That got your wife. That's right. Hallelujah. Uh, she fall under the all thing. In all things. Yeah. Watch thou in all things. Amen. Watch yourself. That's right. That's right. Amen. That's right. Watch yourself that you put nothing in front of the instructions I gave you. Watch thou in all Don't things. say, well, what you mean watch your wife? You want to make sure that the love you got for her and the love she got for you don't be so overwhelming until you bargain. That's right. And then make the step aside from the instructions that I'm giving you. Watch thou. How much? Watch thou in all things. If you become prosperous Hallelujah. in material things, watch it. What? That, that's right. Yeah. That's right. Watch it. Watch thou in all things. That materialism don't take you over. That's right. Hallelujah. Glory to God. Even if you sit under the teaching, you better watch the knowledge that you have. That's right. That you don't get uplifted in it. Watch thou in all things. That's what you mean, watch thou in all things. Monitor everything. That's right. Hallelujah. Monitor. Hallelujah. Everything. That's right. Why is it necessary? Because your soul is at stake. That's right. Hallelujah. Do you see what I'm talking here? But watch thou in all things. Hallelujah. That's a beat. God. Hallelujah. Watch. Watch thou in all things. Hallelujah. Doesn't matter how successful you are out there, Timothy. That's right. I watch. want you to watch. Watch. That's watch right. them that get close to you. That's right. Watch them. Wonderful, brother. Watch them that say, I love you. You're my brother. Watch uh -huh. thou. Watch, watch thou. thou. That's in all things. In everything. That's right. Glory to God. Hallelujah. Yeah. Watch thou in all watch things. Watch thou. You see, the apostles gave the brothers excellent heaven sent instruction. That's right. So they don't be lost. That's right. That's right. Instructions. Is protection. Amen. But the instructions only give protection when you remember thou that remember the thou. thing That's right. that thou has learned. That's right. Eh? That's right. And otherwise than that, you can get instructions all day. But if you don't remember the instructions that's given to you and be mindful, then you know your salvation hang. On what you remember, That's right. what was taught to you. First Corinthians chapter fifteen and at verse one. Someone say, "Well, I'm baptized in the name of Jesus Christ. I have the Holy Ghost speaking in tongue. That's wonderful. That's Happy right. for you. Praise the Lord." Amen. But if you don't remember, that's right. That's right. What was preached unto you? Mm -hmm. Your belief in the baptism mm -hmm. and your belief in the actual Holy Ghost. That's right. Will be counted. In vain. In First Corinthians chapter fifteen, so one said, one. "What?" That's right. But Pastor, I thought when I received the baptism in water in the name of Jesus Christ, Holy Ghost speaking in tongue, and continuing the apostles' doctrine, I'm saved. How can you continue in something unless you remember the teaching that pertained to it? That's right. You can't continue in something you don't remember. Amen. Hear that? First Corinthians 15, we'll start at verse 1. Oh, praise the name of God here. Yeah. Moreover, brother. What? Moreover, brother. That means I'm telling you, 
over and over right. and over That's right. and over mm -hmm. and over. How often? Just more over. More over. Being consistent and reminding you about the same thing. More over. Calling your attention to the same thing. That's right. Why? Because your soul is at stake and you want to be mindful. That's right. Uh -huh. More over, brother. More over, brother. I declare unto you the gospel which I, I preached unto you. I declare unto you the gospel which is preached unto you. Which also ye have received. Which also ye got. And wherein ye stand. And ye stand in what ye got. By which also ye are saved. Uh-oh. Amen. Here's the catch that most folk forgot and don't even know about. By which also ye are you saved. You are saved by the gospel. If. What? If. If. You are saved by the gospel. How? If. If what? Ye keep in memory what I preached unto you. And if you don't remember what I preached, what's your end? Unless ye have believed in vain. Amen. 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 That's right. That's why you got to beware of false prophets who come and undo. That's right. The teaching that was done. That's right. Are you getting it? By which also ye are saved. By which also ye see. If. If. Ye keep in memory what I preached unto you. Ye keep in memory. Amen. If the mother's a little warm, kind of help her up if she's too warm and. Let's take her in the lobby there, where it's more of a breeze. Some of you young sisters give the mother a hand. Real quick now. Some of you young sisters give the mother a hand. Take her there in the lobby and, you know, get some air. Yeah. Give her a hand, one on each side, and give her a hand. Get some air and take some water there. And if she start getting too chilly, just bring her back. Let her sit right in the seat over there where you can take her out in the door. Uh, brother, you, the brother security that's sitting in the chair, you set your chair out there so she don't stand. And I keep the doors open, let her get some air. And when she's satisfied, roll her back in. Amen. God bless mother to uh, see July. She'll be 90 years old. That's a blessing. Amen. 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 All right, let's go to work. First Corinthians 15, I'm at verse 2. Follow me now. By, by which also ye are saved. Ye are saved. If ye keep in memory. Look at I, the terms. If. If. The Bible said men have sought out many inventions. Therefore, you can hear this message all day, every day. Right. It's at your exposal. That's right. To keep you up to date to what you've been taught, look at the device That's right. that you have. You can pause, rewind, get your Bible. That's right. If you don't remember what is preached unto you, Amen. your years of tarrying for the Holy Ghost didn't obtain it. Yes. And being baptized in the name of Jesus Christ, won't save you. That's right. It won't save you if you don't remember what is taught. Your very belief in the Bible itself, God will count it in vain. vain. In vain. Won't profit you. That's right. That's right. Are you listening to the old man? By which also ye are saved. Give chapter and verse again. First Corinthians 15 and we're at verse 2. By which also ye are saved. Ye are saved. If. What if? That's like a glitch there. <laughs> That's right. He's laying terms to salvation. That's right. He's laying terms to your salvation. That's the right. time you spend watching a bunch of foolishness, the time you spend trying to read some book of love stories and all that recycled trash <laughs> that come out of hell. That's right. The word of God speaks plain here. By which also ye are saved. Ye are saved. If. If you keep in memory what I if preach, if you remember you, what is preached, unless and if you don't remember what is preached, you have believed it in vain. That means you're coming to church, yeah, you're shouting, your baptism, yeah. your tongue talking. That's right. None of it. That's right. Will be profitable to you That's right. when Jesus comes. That's right. It is deep. Amen. That's why when we tell you more, take time. Get off your computer looking at foolishness and pull the word of God up. That's right. Get your Bible. That's right. Follow me in your Bible. Amen. You know, a lot of y'all write scriptures and don't never use that pad when you go home to look at the word of God of the scriptures that you wrote. That's right. That's 
Got scriptures written everywhere. <laughs> everywhere, all over the place. All over the place. Never take the time. If you don't get this in you, if you don't get this in you, Amen. you are praying for false prophets. That's true. That's true. False prophet that come right among you. Yeah. Or you will look at a false prophet yeah. on internet, right. or on television, or listen to him on the radio yeah. with that damnable doctrine, and he has dressed it up with Bible. That's right. And because you're not paying attention to teaching, he started itching your ears. It's, that's right. Huh? That's right. What you mean itching ears? It starts sounding good to you. Yeah. Brother used to be in the truth of God from Mississippi. Got tied up with a false prophet in Mississippi. I talked to the brother about two weeks ago. And he said, well, Pastor Jennings, the, the false prophet convinced him there are no more apostles now. And the brother been under me. He convinced him, there's no apostles now. There's no tithing. No more tithing. No apostles. The false prophet don't believe in tithings. He don't believe in apostles. He don't believe in feet washing. He don't believe that there's no more prophets in the church. And now the brother said, well, he showed me in the Bible. Now you see what I'm talking? That's right. It doesn't matter because you sit in the truth. You sitting on benches. It's what you're sitting in getting in you. That's it. The Bible speaks plain. By which also you are This is a warning. Amen. Give chapter and verse. 1 Corinthians chapter 15 and we're at verse 2. By the which also ye are saved. Listen. Amen. You are go back with Jesus. If. If. Ye keep in memory. If. If. You are meant the first resurrection. Hallelujah. Amen. If. If ye keep in memory. You remember. What I preached unto what you. What the apostles preached. Unless. Unless. Ye have believed. Your whole life of coming to church. In vain. It ain't worth nothing. That's right. Nothing. Worth nothing. Hallelujah. Go and take God. In vain. Won't be worth nothing. That's right. That's right. Jumping and shouting, getting happy over the word, don't mean nothing. Amen. If if you keep in memory, you don't keep in memory. But I preached unto you what the apostles had. Unless you have believed in vain. I even talked to the brother. I said, ask the preacher. I showed him First Corinthians twelve twenty eight. God has set some in the church. First apostle. I said, now what you do, you go ask the preacher to show you in the Bible where God took him out. Right. I said, that's all. That's right. That's right. I read to him, he set some in the church, first apostles, second daily prophets. I said, just ask the preacher when did God take him out? Yeah. That's all you got to do. I said, I'm going to give you a Bible where he put him in. All the preacher got to do is give you a Bible that reverse it. That's right. Where God took him out. Yeah. Wonderful. Haven't heard from the brother since. What did he do? Backslid. My Lord, my Lord. Amen. This is why we preach so hard, so firm. Yeah. I don't care nothing about your shouting. No. You can fall out till you blend it with the carpet and your camouflage. And when people step on you, they think you are the carpet. That's right. How many years you had the Holy Ghost have no relevance. That's right. The word of God speaks plain. By which also ye are saved. They, listen, they backslid from Jesus. Yes, they did. When he was here in the flesh. That's right. And before he came in the flesh, they backslid from God, the eternal spirit. That's right. And Satan done it. That's right. Satan duped an entire third. Amen. Amen. Even when the apostles was walking the earth. Yeah. They backslid from the message they were preaching. That's right. Hal Hymenius, yeah. Alexander, Alexander. Blaspheme, Blaspheme. That's right. the coppersmith. That's right. Many got taken over. Yeah. Why they wasn't rooted. That's right. Wasn't grounded. That's right. Busy jumping. Don't <laughs> brag because you're in the truth of God. It's the truth of God in you. Amen. That's why the devil know that this message of holiness is the strongest message in the world. Yeah. Very strong. That's why the false prophets, they don't bother these mega preachers. 
No. They attack the truth of God. That's right. Because they see the strength in it. Amen. They say, Hallelujah. Glory to God. They see the firmness in it. That's right. That's right. You can't turn on no church program and see all these men. No. No. You see a bunch of fairies. That's right. Dairy queens. That's right. And mostly all the women. Amen. Amen. Are you listening? By which also ye are saved. If you keep in memory what I preached unto you. Do you hear this? Unless you have believed in vain. Unless you believe in vain. In vain. If thou put the brethren in remembrance. Do you hear this? Now in 1 Timothy chapter 4 and we're at verse 6. If you put the brethren. In remembrance of these things. In remembrance. Of these of things. Of these things. Thou shalt be a good minister. Wait a of minute. Them. Amen. You see, I, I, I'm, I'm, I'm not boasting, but I'm a good minister. You're a good minister. Because I'm keeping you in remembrance That's right. of what the Word of God said. That's right. The Bible told me what I am if I keep you in remembrance. Do you hear this? If that, in 1 Timothy 4 and verse 6. What is it? If thou put the brethren in remembrance of if these things. If you put the brother in remembrance of these things. Thou shalt be a good minister. You will be a good minister. Of Jesus Christ. Of Jesus Christ. Never stop. Nourished up in the words of faith and of good doctrine. That's what I want you to be nourished up. Nourished up. I want you to be all fat from the preaching. That's right. Yeah. That's right. That's why we got milk to give you and meat to give you and bread to give you. That's right. Nourished up. When you come to church, Hallelujah. come to eat. That's right. Don't come to socialize. No. Don't come to look for a wife. Don't come to look for a husband. That's right. Don't come because you miss your friend. That's right. I don't care who you miss. Amen. You come to church to hear yeah. from God and eat God's hallelujah. That's right. Eat God's word. That's right. Hallelujah. Don't forget hallelujah. what church is for. That's right. Church is for nothing else. Glory to God in the days of Noah. Amen. When God instructed him to build an ark for the saving of the house, the ark represent the church. That's right. Eh? Thank God when the ark, the ark couldn't move until the water came. That's right. I said the ark couldn't move right. until the water came. That's right. Amen. The church can move until water comes. Amen. One water, this speaking of the of spirit. The spirit. Right. Hallelujah. Hey. That's right. Your church needs the spirit of God. Amen. Thank God when the water began to build up, the ark began to rise. That's right. And sell afloat. Amen. When the spirit of God built up in you, you'll find yourself rising. Oh, yeah. Growing. Hallelujah. Growing. Hallelujah. In knowledge and wisdom and divine understanding. That's right. That's right. But you have to get this in you. Amen. The Holy Book says. If thou put the brethren in remembrance of these if things. If you put the brothers in remembrance of this. Thou shalt be a good minister of Jesus Christ. You'll be a good minister. Of Jesus Christ. That means that Jesus will be pleased with you. That's right. Nourish up. In the words of faith. In the good words. Doctrine. That give us belief. And of good doctrine. What, how, what kind of doctrine? Good doctrine. Good. The truth of God doctrine is good. Good doctrine. Not corrupt. That's right. Not mixed with the ideology and the feelings of men. That's right. Wonderful. Not mixed with my opinion. No. The moment the opinion of men get in there, that doctrine cease to be good, it become corrupt. That's right. Hallelujah. I have to give you good doctrine. Good doctrine. Pure scripture. That's right. Nothing watered down. That's right. If you can't take it, that's you. You might as well just stick around until you can adjust to the bitterness thereof. That's right. When it hits your mouth, it's sweet. When it gets to your belly, it'll be bitter. Oh, yeah. We're not going to dilute it. No. We're not going to water it down. Oh, no. no, sir. Oh, no. Amen. Wonderful. Bro. This is a straight drink here. <laughs> yes, it is. <laughs> Huh? That's right.